back everyone. This is Donnie and you are watching Diamond Painting by Donnie. Today is a sneak peek for Diamond Art Club's new releases coming out this Saturday. Now they've started changing how they're releasing them because of the shortages. Uh, so what they do is they open it up to Ruby and Diamond members for the first 30 minutes of release and then after that everybody is open to buy them. Because uh, I guess a lot of people were, were um, not getting a chance to buy them because they weren't Ruby or Diamond members, and I could see why that could be a little upsetting. But then again, you know, to keep it fair to those that have purchased a lot in order to get the status of being able to get um, early sneak peeks, you know, so it's kind of give and take there, and it is understandable. Um, so today's sneak peek is called Sweet Tooth. This is what it looks like here, but I will put a bigger image of it up on the screen right here. And this image is done by Micah Jelena. She is the artist. And I just wanted to show you this box because if you missed my last unboxing and sneak peek video that I did, um, if you want to watch it, I will put a link to it up right there. But um, this, this is a new design for the boxes. I do have a couple more that... Um, my new releases from last week that I want to show you, but I'm only going to do this sneak peek in this video. It kind of got a little confusing for some people because I did new releases and a sneak peek in one video. So trying to save time didn't work uh, to my advantage too much with, um, anyway, so this is the new design on the box and I did show one of the diamond paintings had this design, um, last my last video but all three of my boxes have it this time and I do see the difference how this has a big holographic circle that says round diamonds round diamonds DIY diamond art kit the square does have a big square and it will say square diamonds so that's just the only change I could see about the box and so let's get into it uh, my little scissors are being used on the other side of the room. So let's make do with the big ones. All right, so a little bit about this diamond painting. It is $54.99 um, at regular price. And, ooh, I do see a difference here. They've got that, well, they've got the sparkly snowflake sparkle holographic in there, but it's not as Bold. You can kind of barely see it on the box. Let's see. You can kind of see it there. It's really faint, but I could tell more in this section. But anyway, you guys really don't care about that, I'm sure. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Micah Jelena, $54.99. This is a round, obviously. It is 56 by 76, so it's a big one. And that is in centimeters for those that do not, are new to the diamond painting world. Um, this has 30 colors, and it has one glow-in-the-dark color. Yes, I would. I just found out today that it had a glow in the dark color because I didn't read the sneak peek that they wrote on their site. Uh, so here's our kit. We'll go over it real quick for those who've never seen a Diamond Art Club kit. The round kits, it does say round tool kit on here, and it will come with a clear tray, a blue standard drill pen. A pen gripper and it comes with a few baggies and it will come with a multi placer either a three or a six and this time it came with a three placer if you don't have never seen one that's a three placer and it comes with two heart-shaped wax 
and then it comes in this bag that is reusable, resealable, and yes, I do reuse these. They are great for reusing. All right, so it also comes with a sticker that has the image on your of the diamond painting and look at those colors oh my goodness look at all those tattoos on her lordy lordy um and it does come with your key here and this actually has 33 colors so i will fix that and let's see the glow in the dark color is going to be a lime green you can tell it's the glow in the dark color because it starts with an e and it's at the end it might you know it could probably be at the beginning but i've never seen them put them at the beginning and they do put ab's at the beginning ab's will start well they'll be below the number 150. Uh, that's how diamond art club does it so let's get into this i'm excited to see this baby and i love how when they um roll them outward like this it makes for un it makes for flattening them super easy. Oh, come on. Dig into the bag. <laughs> All sorts of issues today, Donnie. All right, this is heavy. Lots of colors. I love how smooth that is. So, yes, this is the top. And for for right now, some of them have been coming with this parchment paper. Uh, not all of them have been coming with it, and it it probably won't continue. They won't be continuing to do the parchment paper. But I'm going to go ahead and just take that out. I do save mine so that when I go to do them, if I want to put the parchment paper I, on them, I can. Or if I want to use them on a different kit, I can. So I'll just pull that out. Sometimes I get parchment paper in my kits that don't actually fit. They're too small. So what else comes with your kit will be this pamphlet here that has some step-by-step -step instructions. It has tips and tricks, and it has a discount code for your next purchase. All right. And then, of course, your bag of round drills it does have the name of the diamond painting and the canvas number and let's see yep on these the canvas number is down here it matches I'd like to make sure they match because I have had it where the drills did not match the diamond painting so 893R GL sure is and it does have the artist name down at the bottom on these newer um canvases so it's michael jelena and diamond art club trademark so let's get a look at this diamond painting we'll look at the drills here in a minute look at this oh she is larger than life oh my gotta move some things out of the way just so i can move have a little bit more wiggle room okay I love these cute little bun ponytails. I love doing Tesla's hair like that. I think it's so cute. Okay, so what is our glow-in-the-dark color? Um, it's going to be P. Wow. Um, so it's this green color here in her hair. So we have it all these spots right through here. A little bit there here and here and so all this here all that those are going to be glow in the dark the little strings hanging down and you know there's some green in this sucker there's a little bit more in her hair here her eyes have the glow in the dark drills the crown has it in several spots right here on the star on this on all these little circle things they all have a couple of that symbol so there is going to be a lot of the glow in the dark and there is a lot of black on this too because the background is pure black 
But there's also a lot of uh, 3865, which is her skin color. Even though the skin is um, staggered in colors, blended, yeah, that's the word, um, but the main color is the 3865, so you're going to see that through here. Her hand, her arm, her, her shoulders, her chest, all of that is 3865. Um, there is a little bit of the other colors too, but that one is the main color. So um, more of the glow in the dark drills we see over here and here and all these strings that come down in her hair and the loop-de-loops here and more on these suckers over here. And so basically anywhere you see green, it's going to be glow in the dark. Her ring and this little mole on her face, a little mole. And we get into more right here, coming down these lollipop sticks. And her bracelet looks like it's one of those candy bracelets. And that's a, one of those ring pops on her finger. I thought that was cute. Uh, so there's a little bit of the glow in the dark colors on her bracelet. And more in the candy over here. There's candy everywhere. And there's glow in the dark drills too. So these gumballs or jawbreakers or whatever, the green ones, they have the glow in the dark. And here, here. And this main color of her, her uh, bodice, I guess it would be called, that is glow in the dark. So all of this green is going to be glowing. Uh, looks like her fingernail right there. I think that's her fingernail. Yep, that's her fingernail. It's funny because this fingernail is um, the green and then the other two are a different color. They are yellow. But there's a lot of that glow in the dark color here. And look how big this is, guys. I mean, it is gigantic. Uh, I can't fit the whole thing in the screen, but I will turn it sideways and then zoom out to get you a better glimpse. So let me zoom out here. So, yeah, that's about what you, I mean, just compared to... That's, I mean, that's big. It's really big. It would take up an entire table if you actually had a full table to work with. Like, I do not because I have stuff everywhere. I have a very small area for filming. Well, it's not as small as some spaces could be, but it's not a good space for diamond painting um, flat on the table. I just can't do it. There's just no room for me to do that here. But there you go. That is sweet... Uh, what, what, what? Sweet Tooth by Micah Jelena. I'll turn it this way. Maybe you can get a better, maybe see it better. You still can't, can't get the whole thing in, but there you can see it from far out. How beautiful that is. Lots of colors. Beautiful, beautiful girl. Love the crown. Love the candy. And I love... The tattoos. These are great. Alright, so you do get a key on the bottom right hand side and the upper left corner. And your thumbnail will be down here at the bottom. So let's take a look at those drills. Okay, I'm going to zoom you in for that. All the way in. And I will set this beauty aside. And we will pull them out. All right. So, what do we have first? What we have first is... Ooh, we'll start with the least amount. 
And we're going to keep an eye out for that glow-in-the-dark one. There you go. All right. So here are some of the colors. Got our reds and oranges. This is the end of the line where they have the least amount of colors, least amount of drills for these colors. But there's some very, very vibrant colors in this diamond painting. There's more. And I think I know which one. It's a pretty big bag of the glow in the dark ones, but there's some, they're a lot of pastels. There's some bright colors and some pastel colors. They're really pretty. I mean, the, the video doesn't do it justice in person. They're just so much brighter. I love these colors. And there's a good selection. I mean, it's not just all purple or all blue, which I love those colors, but it's got a little bit of everything, it seems. I mean, there's only 33 colors, but they, it's not just like a bunch of 10 different shades of brown or blue. I mean, you might consider this 10 different shades of blue, but they're pretty and they're not like so close together that they look like each other. And then here's our next. This one has a little bit more in these bags. So this gray I'm thinking is like the outer portion of her face, um, maybe, because uh, the only other white I see is the 3865. So since that's the main face, face color, I'm thinking the gray is gonna be like the um, blending outer portion of the face and the skin. And then we got more beautiful blues and pinks. And then the 3756, not sure where that's gonna be. If it's going to be the face or the candy, one of the two, or the background. But look at those blues. Oh my, oh my. I love those colors. And then our 3865. And then we get our last, which has a little bit of this um, lilac color. And then uh, some of those green. And then we get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bags of black. And then a large bag of our glow in the dark drills. And I've tried to get them to glow in the dark in um, the bag, but I can't seem to get them to work to glow. Um, let me try something here. All right, I got a flashlight here, and I'm going to try to just see if I can get the gl some glow off of it. But I think it's too bright in here to be able to see any of that. But let's just try. I'm going to just put that light on there. Let me turn my overhead light off. See if we can get some kind of glow off of it. Yep, I can see some glow. I don't know if you can see that. but you probably can't but yeah I could see a little bit of glow in there I'm trying maybe you can see it I don't know but yeah they definitely glow and I think that's gonna be just so cool when this is done so let me turn my light back up and move my flashlight out of the way so there we go. This is Sweet Tooth. Sweet Tooth by Micah Jelena. And this will be released Saturday, which is May the 30th. Wait, today is Thursday, yes. So May the 30th. It will be released at 9 a.m. for Diamond and Ruby members, Pacific Time. And then at 9.30 a.m. it will be available to everyone else in the world. So if you like this or any of the other ones that you have gotten a sneak peek of, either from in my group or from the Diamond Art Club group, um, set your alarms. I do. 
I definitely set my alarm so that I can make sure to be right there at 9 a.m. to be able to purchase the ones that um, I want. And this week, I can tell you, I want all four of them. <laughs> and that's just saying because the art is by artists that I prefer buying paintings from. So that just happened to be the way it is. And there's a lot of rounds coming out right now. But it will balance out and have a, a lot of squares coming out um, in the short future. The reason is, is just because of COVID and they just, it was what, what's available for them. So they have to go with what they can do. So the rounds are what they're coming out with more of right now. But if you're a square lover, don't worry. They will get your back as soon as they get their squares. So let me know down below what you think of this Micah Jelena um, painting. I love Micah Jelena, so, you know, I love it. And, you know, all these colors, you just can't go wrong with so many beautiful colors. And a ton of black. For those that like to color block, there's a good amount of color blocking in this diamond painting. But there is also a lot of confetti. So, let me know what you think. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would be greatly appreciative if you could go ahead and hit that subscribe button because I know approximately 85% of, of the people that watch my videos are not subscribed. So join my family, join my diamond painting family, hit that subscribe button and then hit that bell so you can be notified when I post new videos. And I try to get the sneak peeks as often as I am able to, um, as often as Diamond Art Club allows me to, I should say. So be looking forward to more in the future. And hit that like button if you could, guys. I greatly appreciate that too. It helps my channel tremendously if you can hit the like button and the subscribe button. So I will see you guys in my next video. Have fun diamond painting. Have a great weekend and don't forget to always sparkle wherever you go and whatever you do. Take care everyone. Bye.